Welcome back to Dreamhack Valencia, or as I like to call it, the 90s disco in Valencia. Because some of these tunes coming off main stage is ridiculous. Anyway, back into this game. It is going to be Epsilon taking on TCM. Epsilon 4 1 up in maps. They only need two more to take away the championship. It is first to six, the best out of 11. And we started with a 3 0 lead Epsilon because of previous scores, and we're starting on board with Zandi in this capture the flag on standoff. Yeah, on board with Zandi. Let's see what we can do on the sticks. Seeing in the mid map at the moment. Oh, okay, let's actually jump on board with Jerd, who is actually quite pushed up at the moment. Shane makes a kill, and Epsilon could be trying to now maneuver into position to try and make a pull, but Rich takes him down and closes down all of the Epsilon pressure. And it now seems like TCM might be the ones who are going to try and make a move on board with Rich as he picks up Zanny. There is a man behind him in the corner as he hasn't seen him. Oh, they've just walked straight past each other. And Rich is going to drop back into his spawn a little bit here. On board with him with the MP7. I believe he's actually in the alcove on the other side of that wall. Oh, it seems as if that's the case, yeah. Oh, yeah, there you go. He's spotted him on the map now. He's going to be looking for the kill as they go in the middle map. <laughs> just going to straight past and take out Rich there. Let's go on board with somebody else. Let's go with Monksy. Yeah, on board with Monksy. He's actually being chased down. They're trying to get away, playing the defensive once again, as it does look like Epsilon are going on the aggressive. Yeah, Epsilon pushing all the way in here. They're fantastic capture of the flag team. Every single time Epsilon push forward, TCM are pushing them back. A little bit, like I said, there is a rivalry between these two teams at the moment, simply because they're both fighting to be number one in Europe. TCM getting a lot of uh, followers and a lot of fans with their performance at Gfini, the weekend just gone, and Epsilon obviously known as one of the best teams in Europe. A lot of fans for them in America as well. Tell you what, they haven't had that bad of a start as Magha picks up a three-piece a three piece though. He's going to absolutely shut that down. Go towards the spawn as well. He's going to pick up one on Karma. Oh. Is he going to get the second as well? It's there for the taking. Oh, he's been shot in the back. The flag is going to be pulled by Shane eventually though. Shane oh, in a good. bad position though. Yeah. And I think he's going to be he's taken down. The there you go. Marky B is going to shut that down instantly. And here comes the counter cap from TCM. One guy left alive for Epsilon and that was going to be Zanity Karma. and Karma's going to push it into the flag it does seem as if Epsilon are getting a very nice spawn though he's going to pull that away and run straight oh, into Karma two gets one. Epsilon players get two. Karma's got this flag away as well they have the spawn they can get these cutoffs it's going to be game over and that should yep. be the flag in it should be but you, if you have oh, a look who's that in the back? Uh, Shane. Shane's there as well Let's see if so Shane can stop it he's going to cause problems if but he can one. get there it's not going to be quick enough though as Karma's going to put the first flag in Great and take by Shane Karma. As well. yeah fantastic play four kill streak very close to his war wow. machine which he picks <laughs> up Karma starting to go off now and this could be the revival of TCM the comeback Karma put so good all weekend every single game you've got to talk about this man Obviously a pickup for this weekend only, usually in Team Envy. Well, recently in Team Envy, I should say. Yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah, he's, he's joined Envy now, of course. Uh, recently left Impact. But on board with Karma still inside his own space. And they really need to try and push out and gain some map control again. Because Epsilon, if they can just get hold of that map, they are going to cause a lot of problems. That's what Karma's trying to do now. Getting hold of that tractor is very much vital. Ooh. Zanny's going to take him out. Now they got him there, but Muxy's going to follow in. Going to give the assist to Karma. Lots of kills going down, and Epsilon are doing good work, but Muxy answering back as well. Going to pick up a second kill as well. Fantastic play by Muxy in the center. Can't knock oh. the third as Shane's going to shut him down with the SMG there. On board with Muxy once again on the respawn, and TCM are being pushed in here. Although seeing that, Rich has pushed out the left hand side. He's really come up against the wall of fire, though. Oh, and actually gets taken down as we switch to him. Going to jump back on board with Kamu, who has his streaks. Looks like they're trying to make another push. Kamu does get taken down, but Monksy and Marky B are there as well. Trying to put pressure on, but Epsilon are fighting back. Joe picking up a kill. Let's get on board with the Shane. Not seen as much of his bamboozling this weekend. Had a few good flag runs. Yeah, it's just that one flag run that he needs to get, and he'd be bamboozling people all over again. Still on board with him with his Scorpion. Oh, fantastic. Taken down, Karma. Karma. I'd imagine Karma's going to be getting some trash talk for that one. As Epsilon look to push in on the flag. TCM still 1-0 up and they're spawning all around it, holding that down. Zanny is there to try and penetrate. He's not having much luck at the moment. TCM defending very, very well here. Still 4-1 down in the series. Can they try and close that gap before 2? So now Zanny still trying to focus. Trying to get in. He's actually got round to the flag. There was another defender. Oh, oh Jed actually picks that up. Karma though, stopping them dead once again. Oh, oh God, what is man. Doing? He's just pulled off another three piece. The guy is absolutely All insane. All this man does is clutch. Every single time, 13 and 8 currently for Karma. Also has that flag capture to his name. And he has all three streaks to play with. Yeah, well, that's going to be the end of the first half. 
Karma going off once again for TCM. And that is going to be the end of the first half. TCM 1 0 up. They certainly are. And at the moment, it does look like TCM have it all their way. They've got Karma with the streaks. So if these two, Karma can drop them, give them an extra, like having an extra man really on the map, just able to stop people where you need to. There we go, Margie B with final kill cam. He really has adapted well to playing with the TCM team, Karma. Yeah, One man wrecking crew. I think it is a case that they've been trying to work him into it a little bit and they're just trying to give him a bit of a free roll because in that position he doesn't really need to, you know, necessarily be so in tune with the rest of the team because all he needs to do is literally run around killing people and that's what he's doing so, so well. Clutch after clutch after clutch and he's done it fantastically the whole weekend. Unfortunately, TCM needs to step up the game a little bit. They're still down the series but they are leading in this map. And as you can see, it's pretty much an even battle for map control at the moment. Yeah, on board with Marky B. Trying to push through the middle here, and it seems to be working. Yeah, they certainly are. Epsilon, going to jump on board with Jerd. Let's see what he can do. Using the M8, actually taking shots, trying to duck out of the way as Karma picks him up. And it does Go seem Epsilon. like both teams just trading kills in the middle of the map. Marky B also goes down and it looks like TCM might now make a push. And here we go, TCM are going to get map control and they need to just hold this down and take their time. I'm all with Marky B, he's going to push right into the spawn here. Going to cause problems and they start need to start winning gunfights here, TCM. Here we go, Marky B, he's going to try and pick up a kill here. And he... Oh, oh no! Oh Shane out God. shoots him! Shane has just absolutely destroyed him there. And Epsilon have got three down. Last guy alive is going to be rich momentarily. And he needs help, although he's going to pick up the grenade kill on Rich, uh, on Shane, sorry. Moxie picking up the kill on Jared as well as Zanky takes out Marky B. Lots of kills, and Epsilon now in control of the map. This is the most important thing, map control. Oh, it gets down as well. Doesn't seem like either team able to make a big push at the moment. Both teams trying to get that flag. TCM aren't giving up either. As Karma, looks like he's going to try and push in. Let's get on board with him. He has out number two to one in this area. Jared able to shut him down and deflect any sort of run he was going to make. Marky B on board with him. Let's see what he can do. He's in the middle of the map. He's gone on board with Rich. Rich looks like he's getting a little bit more aggressive. Going to come around this corner. Is a player to his right. I don't think he's seen him. He hasn't. Yep. Epsilon now make a couple of kills. Who is that coming around the back? It is Shane. It's going to be Shane against Karma. Bamboozle the TCM team and Karma's going to shut him down once again. But here we go. Epsilon are pushing right in now. There's four TCM players in and around Grannies who need to do something to stop this Epsilon attack. Zanny's going to get the kill on the Monksy. And they are pushing in strong now. Yeah, they've been reinforced. All their team is in this area. They've dropped Marky B. Karma actually picks up Jerd though. Zanny looks like he's going to try and pull the flag. Oh, he didn't get the turn on, but Shane's helped him out there. Zanny oh, not going to get away. Monksy shuts them down. Mad Cat turns, returns the favor. Karma takes out Mad Cat and returns the flag. And, there, and once again, he's close to some score Epsilon streaks just again. can't get this away. Every single time they're being pushed out and shut down by the TCM defense. And once back on board with Karma, still has his streaks, hasn't had to use them yet. No, I don't think he will use them. He is about to recycle them as well if he picks up one or two more kills. So I think, you know, he probably won't use them though. He doesn't want to waste them because if he doesn't pick up that kill, then it will have been a waste of the score streak. But here goes Rich with the flag. He's going to run straight through the center. I'm going to take out Zanny as well on his way. He's going to run that. And I'd imagine he's going to run it all oh, the way. Oh, my cat. cat. Going to shut that down with a fantastic shot. Karma's going to be able to pull it away. Is he going to be able to get across from the tank? Oh, he's just managed to dump it. Get Can he jump it again? There. There's a player there. Oh, he gets it he's in. getting the flag in. That's going to be 2-0 now. 2 TCM. Epsilon, can they answer back? I don't know if they can. Someone else just got... I believe that was Karma. Did Karma just get another yeah, uh, he's war machine? he's just restocked on it, yeah. He just restocked <laughs> his war machine. Karma not actually had to use these yet. So he can break the map wide open if he needs to. But it looks like Epsilon now coming for them with full force. But that has actually been deflected by TCM as both Karma and Mark B pick up kills. Have a quick look oh at the scoreboard. My God. Karma, 23 and 13. Two captures, two returns. I believe Rambo was in the chat earlier. He's new teammate, so I'm sure he's going to be happy about Karma's performance this weekend. The guy has been on fire. Yeah, Karma playing fantastically well here so far. Really trying to get TCM back into this game now. And it's looking like it's going to be 4-2 in the end. Here comes the score streaks. He's just going to try and slow down Epsilon take down Mad Cat down the alley side and he will know that they are there the flag has been pulled though oh and they managed to get away with it actually it's going to take out the war machine <laughs> oh yeah, no taken down happen. by Zanity that flag is away just got one ball with Jerd can he get this down oh shot out of the air Mad Cat's the only one up he's got to do something well. and he doesn't Rich it looks like he's going to return that yeah flag has been returned that's going to be the map surely to TCM now 
There is nothing that Epson can do, although Rich is probably going to get shut down from Combo this dropping the hammer, though. Oh, there you go. Mad Cat is now going to shut down that fly, but it's still 2-0 to TCM, and they're going to probably bring this map by now. Yep, it's pretty much impossible for Epson to do. That's going to be the map to TCM and 4-2 in the series. Certainly is. TCM determined to come back, and this is Karma. Now it looks like he's just going to use the war machine for a few more kills at the end of this. So those are your final scores, ladies and gentlemen. 2-0. Uh, Karma 27 and 15 and almost got the tunnel with the he war did. machine in the background and that, they pretty much all played Rich 20 and 20 Monkey B 16 17 they made crucial kills though I Shane mean, if you look at those returns not having the greatest of games only one return from Epsilon so that, that game that was all about Karma oh just. yeah Karma going off in the set, just in the centre of the map controlling it fantastically I mean he did get those two flag runs but only when he it actually helped out to get four Epsilon players down and we're going to go once again to a very quick break. So you don't need to have to listen to us waffle guys. We're not really having a break for anything else. But we are just going to go to a very, very quick break in between the maps. And we'll be back with you very, very soon.